Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm the Novel Crown because I love bags, purses, and all things novelty. So this weekend it's gonna be nice and warm in the 80s. I'm loving the weather and I love how sunshiny it is and the birds chirping. And hopefully wherever you are, you're doing well. So I wanna show you guys my Dooney and Berg Hattie. I really like this bag. Um, so I was watching Just One Espy's Layla, her channel. She has a few Hatties and she was just talking about how wonderful they are and how much she loved them. And she had a, uh, a few different colors. So anyways, I remember sitting there watching it like, oh, that's a really cute bag. I really like it. I like the leather. But the second she said, oh, you guys should smell the leather on this bag. It's so wonderful. Just that, you know, that Dooney and Burke leather. Immediately I knew I had to try this bag out and see for myself. And yes, this bag smells so good. I really like it. It's really nice. Very, very nicely made. I love the stitching on this bag. It's so pretty. I love how they have the drawstring and at the end has the little, you know, catch right there. So this part doesn't come off. There are feet on the bottom right there. The back, it does say um, genuine Florentine Vachetta leather. Love that. And it's just an all around really nice bag. The handle or the strap is really nice. It fits perfectly over the arm. I like the hardware that they chose for this bag. It has the little duck right there. On the other side, it says Dooney and Burke. And on this side, it has that ring, and it's just a really well-made bag. Now, on the inside top right here, if you can see, this part right here is like a suede. I think that's what it is. It's like a suede. You can like feel how soft that is and smooth, and it has leather on the lining. So, yeah, it is just a really, really nice bag. It's really well-made, and I like it. So, let me show you guys what I packed in it. Okay, so first I wanna show you my purse charm. So I got this from Charmed by Carmen. Now she's on Instagram and she does have a YouTube channel and I'll link that below. But I love this charm that she made for me. So I reached out to her and asked her if she could make me a charm. And you know, I just think that she does such a great job and it goes well with the bag. And I love the gold, because the gold hardware. But yeah, it's such a really beautiful piece. She does a great job with her charms. And so on the inside, this is what it it looks like kind of like a bird's eye view just to kind of look down in there and see what all I have that's what I like about this bag you can open it up and you can get it gets really wide and you can kind of see everything down in your bag now first let me just show you guys some of the things that I have so I have my this is called a keep going kit and it is just a first aid kit and it's really small compact and it's from the um, the company or brand keep going and on the inside it just has some first aid things, some band-aids, and it came with all of this. So it has band-aids and sting relief, alcohol pads. Um, it also has, I know, some triple antibiotic. It has like some aspirins and some hand sanitizer. So yeah, this is just a really nice little compact first aid kit just to throw in your purse because you never know, you might get a cut or a scrape or something you need to um, have some first aid for. Now the next thing I have, so I got this right here from Hobo. So that's the um, company's name. And I'm using this for a tech case. The name of this is, ooh, I don't remember the name of it. I think Bliss, maybe. I think that's the name of this little bag right here, Bliss. But on the inside, this is what I'm carrying. So I have my phone charger. I have my um, ring clicker. I know I've shown this on a few videos, but it's just a little clicker right here. And the clicker, for those of you who don't know, for um, this is for like scrolling or like um, switching pages on your phone and stuff like that. Um, I have, so I've been wearing my Apple Watch more, and it actually needs charged right now, because <laughs> I've been really trying to do good with my steps and things like that, but right here, this is an Apple, or yeah, watch charger. I don't know if it just does Apple watches or other watches as well, but I just plug it on the side of this and then stick my um, watch on there and just lay it down and it'll charge my watch just fine. So I have that in there. I have, let's see what else. So I have these lights. Have you guys seen these lights? These lights are from, 
I want to say I got them from Timu. I'll look and see, and I'll um, put the link if you're interested in looking for these. But I always forget where I got stuff from. As you know, there's Sheen and Timu, and what's the other one? AliExpress and Wish and all of those. Sometimes I forget. But anyways, I thought that this was really cool because you can put, whoops, sorry if that blinds you, but you can put your light on the end of whatever charger you already have and it makes it into like a little flashlight. Here's the smaller one. But yeah, that's what it looks like and it's actually pretty bright. And I thought that this was cute and you know how much I love novelty, you guys. So if it's novel, I like it. So let's see what else I have in here. Oh, okay, so on the bottom there is a zipper and in the zipper compartment, I have the cords that I can plug into my charger so that um, I can charge either my phone or my iPad or whatever it is that I'm looking to charge. And this right here, this is just a traditional little flashlight. And this came in a set. I wanna say it was like, maybe like a large and a medium and some other sizes. And I'm just carrying just the smallest one. But yeah, I thought that that would be really fun to carry in the purse and plus it's that little gold color that kind of matches with their other um, bag accessories let's see what else do I have in here oh so I got this from Etsy and I know you guys who have been following me have seen quite a few things that I have lately been um, like getting personalized and customized for myself because you want to know something I figure if I can carry Dooney and Berg you know, Coach, Vera Bradley, and all these other stores, and I can have their name on products, why can't I have my name? So some of the things that I've been getting has Tiara or the Novel Crown on it. And this is just one of the things that says Tiara. So I'll link this, um, this notebook right here, but it's actually really nicely made. So it's leather. There are pockets like um, that you can put like cards in right here and a pocket right there. And now this book I got from Amazon, and I want to say it came in a set of either four or five. I'll look and I'll link that too if you guys are interested in getting this and you want some of these books. And they're all different patterns. And here's my pen. But yeah, I just thought that this was like a really cute little notebook that I can just jot some notes down in and I'll actually hold some cards in it. And this right here is a pen that I got. It says the Novel Crown and Tiara. And it lights up. You guys know how much I love stuff like that. If you can kind of see, yeah, it says the novel crown and it says tiara. But like I said, no, I mean, I think that it's really fun to have all the different brands, but it's also fun to have your name on stuff too. Okay, so the next thing I have is, so you guys, this actually, I'm using it for a cosmetic bag or a catch-all. But you know what it really is? Hold on, let me get the label so actually so i got it from hobby lobby and it is a double-sided hoop case so you're supposed to put like um sewing supplies and things in it like that but i am using it for a little catch-all look at this when you open it up so there's these two compartments right here and on this side i have like a lot of my lip things you know i have my lip balm I have my um, chapstick and I have my Be Bella and I have, this is a little lipstick that I got out of the, I think it was called Garden Party. I put it in a community post um, that Macy's was doing. And then on this side, I just have some makeup products and I have a mascara and I have a eyeliner and a little touch up makeup. But yeah, I just thought that this would be really fun to turn into a makeup bag. Now I don't even do any needleworking or embroidery, which is what you're supposed to use this bag for, but I think it's fun anyway to use it for a cosmetic bag. So in, inside, this is how it looks. Now I could really pack this. I could put like quite a few things in here, but I have my, um, my little perfume. I have, I think I only have one toothpick lacquer left in there. I have my clear eyes eye drops. I have my lotion. I have my perfume. I have a contact lens case just in case I need that. And I have some Vaseline and a little thing just in case I have a stray hair that I need to get off or anything. But yeah, I just thought that that was just so fun to do and to pack it into and make it into a cosmetic bag that you can obviously use it for what it's intended for, but that's just what I'm using it for. And it fits really well down in the bag as well. 
Okay, so the next thing I have in here, so this is my Dollar Tree light. I know you guys have seen these. Um, some, you know, other people have been um, posting these on their videos, but it's from the Dollar Tree, and it's just one of those lights where you can put it on the inside of your purse. I think it's supposed to be actually a selfie light, but I'm using it for a purse light, and it is rechargeable, which that makes it really nice. You see that in there? You just put your charger in there, recharge it, and keep right on going. So the next thing I have, so I got this case from Timu, and what it is, it's actually a makeup brush case, but I use it for a snack case. You can put a bar right here and a bar right there, and it helps it not to, it helps your bars not to get crunched at the bottom of your bag. So I have my glasses case. I know a lot of people have been asking about this, and then I posted in the community post when Vera Bradley did their outlet, and I want to say it was like $7 and something this last time around, which is a really good deal because it's just a little nice thin glasses case. Put your glasses in there and it doesn't take up hardly any room at all. Plus, I liked that it was blue. So I have, so this is another thing that I got personalized um, from Etsy and has my name on this side. And on this side, it says the novel crown. I don't know how well that picks up on camera, but it says the novel crown. And this is a card case, and I just have my cards in there. And yeah, I just thought it was something fun that I could do. I've been really enjoying personalizing things. Like I said, if I can carry other brands, then why not? Why can't I carry the Novel Crown? Okay, so the next thing I have, so this is another piece to the same set. And I will link this um, store below so that you guys can see if you're interested. But this side says Tiara. This side, again, says the Novel Crown, and it has my change and some little bit of cash in there. Now, I don't carry much cash, but you never know when you might need a couple of dollars for something. And this is actually really, really well made, just like the other case and everything. Like, it's leather. It's really, really nice. Very, very sturdy. They just did a really good job. And it's actually really easy to go in there and customize the things that you're wanting to do. Now, the next thing I have is my wash and dry um, set from Zinni. Um, that's where I got my glasses from. And all it is is just you open it up. And this is the little spray bottle right here. And then behind it is just the cloth. Just in case my glasses get dirty, I can go ahead and wash them off real easily. Okay, and the next thing. So you want to sip it. <laughs> okay, so I saw this on Timu. And you know what I really liked about it? I liked the case. So this is a pen. And you see how it has this case right here? This is actually a fountain pen. Now, it's a really, really nice fountain pen. But I was looking at the case because you guys know how I love novelty, right? Well, the the case, there's this rubber part right here. And I kept thinking, well, if I don't like the pen, I know I would love the case because I can put pens in it. You know, similar, let's just say my novel crown pin let's just say i wanted to put that in there i could put that in there and i can close it and i can have my little pin i know it's silly but i just really like it and so this pin so i've actually been into fountain pins lately and this pin is so nice and so heavy duty like it's just very very substantial now look at that i don't know if you could see that isn't that pretty isn't that really nice can you see that I love this pen. I really do like it. And I'm learning how to write with with fountain pens. I'm not very good at it yet, but I'm going to just keep trying because I also got a couple of pens that I have coming that I had ordered because I liked this one so much. And they have other colors of the pen, but my thing is, like I said, I, write, I really liked the case to it. So that's the whole reason why I got it. Now here's another pen. Now look at this. So this came from um, Stationery Pal. I don't know if you've heard of them, but they have a lot of really cute stationery things. And this is a like hand sanitizer pen. So it's a pen like that, a pen. And then on this side, there's a spray. So it's hand sanitizer, or I mean, I guess you could put like water in it if that's what you want it, but I put hand sanitizer in mine and I thought that that was just really cute. It says Daisy and they have um, some other colors as well. Now the next thing I have is my card case for my little YouTube card. So I know I've shown these, but for the people who haven't seen it yet, I got this from Vistaprint 
and I got it embossed and it just says the novel crown, you know, like when I'm out somewhere or something, um, I can just give people a card who are interested in my channel or who like purses. And on the other side, it's just my rackets and link. And then I just thank people for using um, my link if they go ahead and do so. And you guys, if anyone ever does use my rackets and link, thank you so much. And let me know so I can personally thank you and also give you tips if you've never used racket and um, before. Okay, so the next thing I have in here, so this is my highlighter set. I know you guys have seen this, but I love this thing. I love this highlighter set. And this one I got off of Etsy and they can put your logo or your name or whatever you want on the front. And it's like, it's not a sticker. Like it's like on there. Like I really like this. And so mine, of course, says the novel crown, but these are just gel highlighters. So you take it out and it's like gel. I don't know if you've seen those before. It's actually pretty new to me, but it's just the gel highlighters and they have other other ones too so they have you see how the orientation right here is like landscape they have it to where you can have your logo or your name in portrait and then they also have a set of five so it has a few other colors or two other colors and then on the inside this tray right here comes out so say you get this made and you have your name on it once the markers are done you can just take the tray out and take the markers out and you just have just a little case to use for whatever you want you know, I love stuff like that. So I just think it's really cute. And I'll link that below if you guys are interested. Okay, so the next thing I have is my AirPods case. And it just has the, butter, the blue butterflies on there. I have, so I got this hand sanitizer case from Bath and Body Works. And I just have it tethered to the inside of the purse. That way, if I ever need, you know, my hand sanitizer, I just pull the tether up, grab my hand sanitizer, and use it. And this is, let's see, I think this is, what is that, cucumber melon? Yeah, so there's cucumber melon in here. And then the next thing I have is this little case right here. So since it's been really hot outside, so it does say the novel crown and tiara, but since it's been really hot outside, I have been carrying my little mini deodorant. You know, the worst thing is to get in the car you're driving down the road and you realize, oh, I forgot my deodorant and it is going to be burning up hot today and I'm going to be sweaty. You know, that would make me actually turn around and go back to the house to put some deodorant on. The next thing I have is, so this is a, oh, wrong side. So this is a little kit and it's a nail kit. So it has um, the fingernail file, the slanted fingernail file, and also a glass emery board right there. So I thought that that was just really cute. I got this from Timu, and it's just really a cute little case. It's very compact, and it's really heavy duty, and it works really, really well. I really like that. It's one of those things that, you know, you're always looking for a, a well, at least I am. I'm always looking for a nail clippers. I have a hangnail or something going on. Okay, so the next thing is, so I have this little case right here and it just has my little tootsie roll fruity chews in here and they were blue i thought blue candy would be fun with this so this is one of those little bags that came from timu this little clear bag and i like the way it works because you can snap it these two ways then on a top you can snap it like that so you have different ways to get into it if you need to but right now i'm just carrying some little fruit chews inside now let's see what's next now. I have my B. So this came from Hobby Lobby and it's just a mirror and it has a little B on the front right there. And it's, you know, just a double-sided mirror, but it works really well. I like it and I like the bees. I really, really like bees. Let's see, what else do I have in here? Is that about all? Oh, so I have, I got this from Etsy too. And I thought that this was really cute because I like sticky notes and it's just a leather sticky note holder and I can put my sticky notes in there and use them and you know it's really cute so this is like um suede right here and then leather and then it has a little latch right there so yeah I'll link that below as well and I'll link all the things that I can if I um have the link for them because you never know you might be looking for some cool little novelty things too I know I always am so let's see what else that might be all i got my little light i have one of my cards 
fell out. I need to put that back. But I also, I have my organizer. So I chose to use an organizer in this bag just because I really do like having a place to kind of put things and then it kind of really helps um, the bag stand up. And I did get this one from Amazon. It works really well. It's just like really thick felt and it doesn't weigh, it doesn't like, I don't think that it puts any really extra weight on the bag or extra weight on the purse, but it does help give it a little, but a little extra structure. And yeah, so that's the inside of the bag. Look at that, isn't that nice? I love how that's like leather and the suede part. I think that's all on the inside that I have there. There's a pocket right here, there's a pocket, pocket and a slit pocket on that side. And then there are two pockets on the wall right here, if you could see that. And yeah, this is a really good bag. It's so well made. It's so nice. I just really, really like it. And I will have a lot of fun carrying this bag this weekend, actually. So as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you saw some novelty goodies that you like. And if you do, let me know which one you like. So anyways, as always, thank you to my new subscribers. Thank you to the ones who have been rolling with me. And hopefully I'll see you again on my next video. Bye.